So what is your friendship like with Selena and with David? I think everyone in the cast is still very close. Obviously, you know, as years pass, people have plans and projects and things happen in life. But when you do a show with someone for so many years, it almost becomes, you know, like a real family. And when you do a show with so many amazing people for so many years, it becomes like a real family. So I think for the rest of our lives, we'll still be involved, whether we like it or not. And it's really great to have a, you know, a family on and off the screen. Could we possibly see a Wizards of Waverly Place reboot happen in the future, do you think? Well, I'm totally down for a Wizards of Waverly Place reboot. Um, Dave and Henry just got married, you know, a few months ago, and the cast basically had a mini reunion at his wedding. And I think everyone's down for a reboot, including Selena. So if she says she's in, I think we're all down for it. The Emoji Movie. Tell us a little bit about the movie and how you, your emoji also in the movie. <laughs> well, in the Emoji Movie, I play Alex, who's one of the non-emoji characters. He's the teenage kid, he's in high school. He's trying to, you know, discover who he is and at the same time get this girl that he really likes um, to notice him. And he has no idea how to do that. So the emojis in his smartphone start sending messages to this girl that he really likes. And from then on, it just creates all this chaos. They go on this adventure within the smartphone itself to save it from being deleted. My character has to learn how to express himself. Uh, and at the same time, everyone has to learn how to be less dependent on emojis. And at the same time, you know, discover who they really are.